Hi there, in this video, I'm going to show you on how you can easily download the picture or visualization that you just created using Napkin AI to your computer. And then later, I'll show you the simplest way where you can get the content or a picture to a document like Google Docs without actually downloading the picture first, which I think is going to be a lot easier. But anyway, let's go to napkin.ai and then start a new napkin. So I'm using the free account because right now the program is still in beta and therefore all users are basically getting the pro versions or pro features completely for free. Anyway, so I'm going to try to create a visualization based on a paragraph that I just created using Proplexity AI. This is basically just a comparison between ChatGPT and Gemini AI. And I want to create a simple visualization using Napkin AI. So I'm going to click on this icon to start the anal analysis process and then let Napkin to suggest a few designs. Uh, okay, there are many designs which I think look great, but let me pick one that I think makes the most sense. Let's try this design. And uh, let me try using this style. There you go. So here, I'm not going to change anything. I'm going to just use whatever napkin I just designed for me. But uh, if you want to download the picture or download this visualization as a picture, you can click on this button that says export. And then here, there are many things that you could work with. By the way, I think I, I, have, I have to mention that you can change the aspect ratio of this design so you can click on this menu and then click this oh sorry click this aspect ratio and i'm going to make it wider like 16 by 9. there you go now let me go back to export menu again and you can select the format that you prefer so there's png svg and that's about it ppt and pdf are not image format only png and svg and in fact i prefer to use png for a simple picture now you can disable napkin logo i do recommend you just disable it especially if you are are able to do that but this is a pro feature at the moment and then you can select the color mode there is light and dark mode it's up to you which one that you want to use the background uh it could be it could be transparent or just a simple plain background again up to you i guess i'm going to be using a white background and resolution i do recommend to actually set it to two or maybe three depending on the size of the paper or the document that you're working on because the one by aspect ratio or the one by resolution is just not big enough so i do recommend to make it double and that's basically all the settings that we need to, to change and i can click this button to start downloading the picture and we got this picture that's quite convenient, right? But there is a simple way to get the visualization from napkin to, let's say, Google Docs without actually downloading the picture first. So if you look closely here, let's go back to the export menu again. Uh, again, you can change all the settings. You can actually just click the clipboard button right here. And you can go back to, let's say, Microsoft Word or Google Docs, and then you can right click click paste or press ctrl v on the keyboard and the document or sorry the visualization will be uploaded to that document instantly without you having to manually download and then re-upload the file to a different platform and i think that method is just way way better but anyway i think that's basically it i hope you find this video to be useful and if that was the case then feel free to subscribe to this channel and i'll see you on my next video have a great day